tributes continue to pour in for late ANC MP Jackie Mufukeng. The former Justice and Correctional Services Portfolio Committee member lost her life to COVID-19 related complications. For more on this, we're joined by the State Security Agency Domestic Branch Head, Advocate Maklodi Mufe. Advocate Mufe, good evening and thank you so much for your time. You've been one of those voices over the last couple of days who've been reflecting on the life and times of um, May Jackie Mufugeng. Tell us a little bit about what you believe her legacy is and why it was important for you to add your voice as well. Uh, good evening and good evening to your, your viewers. Uh, the sad passing away of May Jackie Mufugeng is a great loss uh, not only for a family but for the whole country as a whole. Um, May Jeki Mufuke was a hard worker. She did her job so diligently that whenever issues which were close to her heart affected anyone, she would get into the ring without soliciting anybody's assistance and assist the most vulnerable. Uh, we recall uh, years gone by, there was a youngster in, in Gangala, Bronco Springs, around there, uh, um, Sindani, uh, Sindani, uh, who needed care because he was, he was a youngster. Um, there was no one ready to come up to the fore, but Mejeki took that youngster uh, into a care and cared for that, for that youngster. And when River Stian uh, Kamp, may his soul rest in peace, uh, was murdered uh, by Oscar Pistorius, uh, Mejeki Mufuke was there again at the forefront um, to basically comfort uh, River's family and all the vulnerable women who are subjected to this scourge of GBV by their uh, partners or husbands and all sorts of things. Uh, it is a great, great loss. And she did this without looking for any accolades uh, or any accreditation or looking for any position but to serve uh, the most vulnerable people in our society. Um, she, she served in the Houting legislature and even there she was just as active insofar as uh, even at national government where she served in two portfolios. Uh, in this instance, the Justice Portfolio Committee. Mm. Um, she made it a point that she executes both her tasks with distinctions. Interestingly enough, uh, Major Kimufuki uh, and she knew a lot, and she read. She is well educated, um, but on matters which she felt that she needed to get some advice, Mejeki Mufuke would call. Would call at any given time and say, I am going to this sort of meeting. I need to understand what is the legal situation, uh, you guys who are lawyers. Uh, and indeed, she will take that advice and run with it. Um, Me Jeki Ufugen was not the one to shy away from any responsibilities. Um, it is so sad that she is gone at the time when she kept on saying, all of us South Africans, we have to put our bootstraps on and rebuild our country. 
Uh, I don't think she ever lived to any other thing except to work for the community, imagine you. Advocate Mufe, tell us a little bit about the kind of relationship that you had enjoyed with her and I suppose just, you know, the kind of person that, that, that she was, even on a personal level. Me, me, Jackie, Mufukeng and I had someone in common we both didn't know uh, that we know him. Um, I got to know her, I cannot remember what were the circumstances, some decades back, when I was basically saying that uh, um, uh, our retired Deputy Chief Justice, Jehav Museneke, is one of uh, our mentors, the youth of 1976, not only in Soweto, but all over, uh, because in 1976, we were all over. We would go to his firm, uh, the firm he had called Madulek Seritje and Museneke then in Pretoria. It was a firm of attorneys. Uh, as young people, we would go and seek for assistance and advice and he took us under his wing. Mm -hmm. And one day I was basically saying, uh, you know, uh, uh, the retired Deputy Chief Justice Moseneke is one of those people I look up to. Um, and uh, she then said, do you know what? He is my relative. And she explained, I think they're very close. And she says, he is also my mentor besides being my relative. Mm -hmm. uh, and each time she needed to get some legal advice, especially uh, in the current portfolio, she said, uh, the Justice uh, Portfolio Committee, uh, she would now and then, you know, uh, solicit advice from me. And, and she was more concerned about ensuring that the bills affecting um, the, our most vulnerable groups must see uh, the light of day in parliament. Uh, and so we engaged a lot, even in terms of talking about the other ills affecting our society. Um, and, and obviously, I also had to keep on encouraging her that uh, she's got to register for, for a law degree. Uh, and she kept on saying, yes, I'm going to do that. But she also had a, a I think it's a diploma uh, in legal drafting. And uh, so she was, she, she was basically this kind of person mm. who, when, whenever we got to engage together, it would have been on something pretty much critical. Advocate Makodi Mofe from the State Security Agency. Let me thank you so much for your time tonight, paying tribute there to the late Jackie Mofugeng.